Hello. In this video, we're going to remove the logic board and the DVD player from a MacBook Pro 15-inch Core Duo computer. So um, let's get started. By now, you should already have the top case off, and it should look something like this. Um, the DVD player is only held in by three screws. You're really going to need a Torx 6 screwdriver for this, because pretty much every screw is not Phillips. It's all the Torx. Uh, it's really going to make your life easy. Looks like. Just kind of pry up gently on this Molex connector for the DVD drive, and then you can lift it right up. It's an easily replaceable unit. Um, okay, so now for the actual logic board, we need to pretty. The easy thing is just to remove all these little connectors. Battery there, and then you can peel up this tape and take off the display connector. This is really small connector here. Be careful not to break any wires. Board. The cooling fan. This one you have to pry up on this brown part here for it to release this little cable. Pull that out. Hard drive. This little express slot. Okay, those look like all the ones on the top side. There's a few on the bottom, but we'll get to those in a minute. Um, take your trusty Torx 6. There's one Phillips screw holding this right here. Okay. Now the Torx 6, I'm going to start over here and start working my way around. Here, there's a couple screws, one holding down this video cable. Push that out of the way. And then there's this one holding down this little plastic shield. The light sensor. to kind of spin it that way, clockwise. Let's get rid of that. Set that aside. Now we're getting there. Take the cooling fans out.
this black torque six screw goes here. Looks like it's a little short. Okay. Now I'm going to get rid of this left side fan. Just kind of rolls up right out of there. Start pulling on the launch board. Looks like I get rid of the right fan too. of cables, there's one here, power cable, and this last one right here. And we've done it. Remove the logic board. Good work.